on you? Yeah, you do. Why, why is that? We're in a public space. Because you don't have my permission. Well, you're in public. That's Doesn't mean you can. It's okay. You know what? You can spread your hate. I'm not spreading any hate. Well, you are because you're saying we do things that we don't. I didn't. But say we love you. You called me over. Yeah, I don't want you to tell me. Well, you're in public. So now you're bullying. So. It's Mary Ugolini here reporting for Rebel News. I'm downtown Coburg, where you can see behind me. The main street has been closed off and will be painted rainbows and colors to celebrate pride. So I wanted to take you on a little sneak peek of just what that would look like in the town of Coburg. Today is Saturday, so let's head in. Yeah, you do. Why, why is that? We're in a public because space. Because you don't have my permission. Well, you're in public. That's Doesn't mean you can... It's okay, you know what? You can spread your hate. I'm not spreading any hate. Well, you are because you're saying we do things that we don't. I didn't But we love you. You called me over. Yeah, I don't want you to tell me. Well, you're in public. So now you're bullying, so... Okay. It's okay, tell me. Yeah, I will. Some 
of the story time. Just, I, you love story time? Just so everyone knows, there could be a possibility of being filmed right now, and it's not out of love, just so you know. But we are all loving here, and we are embracing ourselves, and we are having a wonderful time, yes? Yes, we are. So one more song, and then we're all going to walk down, and we're going to read some stories together. Yay! Oh, God, it's hall order. Here we go. I don't know if this is... All right, so some of you may have seen on that little video, and it's someone who I know personally, um, but their baby was quite upset being put into the face of a drag queen. And so out of privacy, I will probably end up blurring the baby's face at least, or maybe even the people that I know. But they, I suppose, alerted the drag queen and some of the event organizers to the fact that I was filming. And that was a non-issue because there are tons of people around filming, taking photos, taking videos. Um, it's a non-issue, I guess, unless you have some views that run contrarian to the drag queen phenomenon, questioning the appropriateness and necessity of gender bending adults, dancing and reading to children. So because I'm alone and some of these events, some people end up becoming quite unhinged, the ones who tout inclusivity and tolerance. I'm going to mosey on, but I wanted to point out that filming, it's, not a, non, it's a non issue and they're in a public space. There's no assumption of privacy when you're out in a public street. It's a good reminder for everybody. And um, if you're not comfortable being filmed, then perhaps what you're doing needs some reflection. That's a wrap at downtown Coburg Pride event. I mean, it will keep going on. There will be the Drag Queen Story Hour and other events ongoing, including the bouncy castles on the street for children. More dance time, I'm sure. Hope you enjoyed this report. For Rebel News, I'm Tamara Ugolini. The capture of traditionally held safe women's spaces by biological males is exactly why we have launched a petition and campaign at keepkidsspacessafe.com. At that special website, you can sign our petition to keep kids and especially female young girls spaces safe. Sign our petition and check out all of our previous reports. That's keepkidsspacessafe.com.